There we go. Oh my gosh. That's the best one today. Easily. <laughs> What up guys, Tim Hunt here, and today we're going fishing. I'm gonna level with you. I'm tired. Like, it's been very, very rough. Yesterday was one of the roughest days of fishing I've had. Lost my phone, twisted my ankle. I was out with Eric. It's a shame I didn't catch, I caught two fish in an entire day of fishing, which may or may not make a video. I don't know, dead batteries on the boat. I had to get a ride back to the ramp, but I'm, I'm, I'm not gonna go any further into detail than that. So here's what we're doing. I have about two and a half, two hours and 15 minutes of light, and then I get to go to church, which is always really refreshing after a rough weekend. I'm gonna hop around to my favorite spots, and I'm catching some fish. And I'm bringing you guys along with me. I don't know what I'm gonna call this video, but sheer will and determination is the theme of this video. And I'm also going to check out a couple of new rods we got. That should be pretty fun, right? All right, let's not waste any time. Let's go catch some fish. Spot number one, you already know where we're going. Heron Lake. I love fishing here. You know, I never catch anything of size here, but I always manage to catch something. The only downside is audio quality. You often have a hard time cleaning up the audio after we fish here. Well guys, that's enough uh, road noise. We're gonna get back to the car and get to the next spot. Here we are. That corner over there yesterday was taken, but there's a bit of structure and lay down over there that tends to hold fish. So we're gonna go straight to that and then just work our way back. We have roughly an hour and 20 minutes of light left if we're lucky. We got all Abu Garcia rods right now. I'm gonna probably cut this lipless off and tie on the Texas rig. We're gonna keep the jerk bait because I really wanna keep catching more jerk bait fish. I actually don't think I've ever fished all the way back here in this corner before. There's usually somebody already back here. It is really peaceful out here. In stark contrast to Heron Lake. Oh, that was a good bite. That was definitely a bite. Hmm. Well, I found my first negative. This thing just <laughs> soaks up all of that gunk. Also, the bottom is loose. A little cap on here. It's easy enough to fix. Oh, that's a decent fish. No way. Hello. <laughs> wow, this rod feels so good. Like, no joke. The bend on this thing is insane. <laughs> Hi, buddy. There we go. Yeah, you're not huge, but you are fat and strong. <laughs> What a beautiful fish. We're grateful for it. Okay, buddy. Let's get you sent home, shall we? Nice. Well, there you have it, guys. And it was about a half hour. We're about halfway through our fishing session over here. But we caught a fish. It was decent. That's four fish on the day. Right after the day, it took me eight-ish hours to catch two fish while Eric caught, I think, six or seven the whole day. I'm pretty pleased. Hope you are too. If you're enjoying the content, feel free to go down and get subscribed if you haven't. I'm really trying to hit 500 subscribers by the end of the year. I have probably the coolest subscriber family on all of YouTube, and I'd love to welcome you to it. All right, let's get back to fishing. I don't know what time it is. 4.09. Yeah, we got 30 minutes, 40 minutes of... Oh, yep. There she is. 
All right. Come on, sweetheart. Come on. You're not as big, but you, you've hit it. These fish are mean. All right. Another healthy little fish. We'd love to see it, but if we're looking for that big girl. Eric has pulled some big fish out of here. I'd like to as well. Aside from trying to hit 500 subscribers, I'm also trying to smash my PB this year. Anything over four pounds would get me there. I said last cast, but I'm not going to leap biting fish to find biting fish. Although I do want to go fish over there near that uh, drain. There's usually a couple of good fish over there. I'm going to skip this platform and go down there right next to the, uh, the drain. Oh, guys, it feels so good. It feels so good to get out and catch fish. You don't understand, like, not just yesterday with Eric. Like, I've fished five, six times since I got back from Wisconsin and I've only got well this video and maybe maybe one more but I don't like it so <laughs> this feels really nice There we go. Oh, goodness gracious, fish. That is, that, that could be a halfway decent fish. Okay. Oh my goodness, let's go. Okay. Okay, I see you. All right. I want to get a weight on her. Okay. <laughs> Look at that. I bet she'd normally be like a two, like a low two, but she is hefty. So let's get that scale out real quick. Set the pounds and ounces. Zero it out with the clipper. Oh, one pound, 15 ounces. One pound, 15 ounces, almost two. Hey, we caught a two pounder today, guys. I was gonna say, she, she's chunky. All right, let's get her back in the water. We want her to stay healthy this winter. <laughs> there she goes. Well, how about that, guys? Yes. <laughs> Fantastic. Whew. And this Cinco is still going. I can't believe it. I love it. I'm so grateful. Man, God is good. God is so good. I mean, <laughs> look what he gives us. Oh, and there's another one. I wasn't even paying attention. <laughs> golly golly another toad another toad are you kidding me are you kidding me another two pounder <laughs> Whew. All right. Oh, she bleeding. Where's she bleeding from? Oh, her lip. Girl, I didn't mean to give you a bloody lip. I am so sorry. Oh no. All right, sweetie. Go on ahead. You good? Oh yeah, she fine. <laughs> Over here giving praise to God. And he was like, okay, Tim, I see you, buddy. I got something for you. And then he gave it to me. 
Very sweet. Thank you, God. Well, we had ourselves a bit of an emergency. We ran out of GoPro batteries, and that is a really good problem to have considering how rough it has been lately. I've only got a couple minutes left of daylight, so I, stra I strapped this GoPro 7 to my head, and I didn't get a single bite over here. So I'm going to go move back to where I was, see if I can't catch one or two more fish before the sun goes down. I knew Sanko would treat me right. It always does. This, you know what? Even if I don't catch another fish, this has been a beautiful, productive day. And you know what? It figures. Whenever I <laughs> just focus on bringing you and me out here, you the viewer that is, and just want to have a good time and redeem myself, we have a great time. I'm so glad I got to bring you guys along with me. It'd be nice if we could cap off the night with the five yonder, but um, I couldn't complain even if I don't catch another fish. Well guys, I think the bite's pretty much shut off, but we're going to keep fishing until you can't see. Let's see if you can still see. You can still see. Okay. We're going to fish until you can't see, and we're going to call it, go get changed, get ready for church. There he is. Oh no, we lost him. Oh, that was a fish, no doubt. <laughs> All right, let's try this again. There we go. Oh my gosh. That's the best one today, easily. Yes, I hope you guys can still see. Look at this rod bend, it's perfect. Come on, sweetheart. Oh, yeah. Oh, man. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Let's get her in the sun. Yep. I ain't mad at it. I'm not gonna weigh her. She's not over three pounds, which is what I would care about. <laughs> there we go. Oh, booger. Got it that time. Oh my, what was that? What in the world? That thing ripped. What the heck? If that was a bass, if that wasn't a catfish, that is the biggest bass I've ever hooked into. That is insane. What are you? Let's go! Let's go! <laughs> yes! Oh my gosh. <laughs> That's a three pounder. Woo! I knew you were there, girl. I don't think this is the one that hit it before, but if it was, good for me. Man. I'm gonna guess three on the dot. Uh, I might be a little bit wishful. Two pounds, 13 ounces. Okay. It says two pounds, nine ounces.
two pounds nine ounces all right but still two and a half pounder she fought like the dickens let's get her put let go real quick we don't want her out of the water for too long all right sweetie Oh, she, she swam back into my hand. There we go. <laughs> she wanted to give me a kiss goodbye. Well, that was something, wasn't it? I, it's dark. We caught a ton of fish. I am just ecstatic. I set out with a purpose today to catch fish, and that's exactly what we did. Oh, today's subscribing friend, the Tim Hahn Fishing Family MVP is going to be Eric. Eric, actually, we were out here fishing yesterday. I was struggling. He was super sympathetic, but I saw him pulling fish after fish on a Texas rig finesse worm. So I didn't have any finesse worms in black and blue, but I had a Senko and that was good enough. So he's definitely the MVP right now. You know who else is really awesome? The rest of my subscribers. If you enjoyed this video, if you enjoyed my content and you're not already subscribed, maybe think about it. I'm really trying to get to 500 subscribers by the end of the year. We're almost there. Ah. But that's all I got for you guys. That Abu, Gar oh, I'm sorry. That Abu Garcia Veritas rod, mwah. We bang flipped a couple of fish with it, just fine. Set into fish after fish after fish. The bend is perfect on that rod. It is definitely one of my favorites. It's right there behind probably the Zodius. It might actually be tied with the Dobbins Fury. It's just that nice of a rod. Um, but that's all I got for you guys. So I need you to remember, stay safe. Stay happy, stay healthy. God bless you. Keep on fishing, and I'll see you in the next one. Man. I'm gonna guess three on the dot. Uh, I might be a little bit wishful. Two pounds. 13 ounces. I'm gonna say two pounds, 13. Yeah, 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 Mr. Woodchuck. I don't want nothing to do with you. <sighs> I'm gonna go two pounds. Stop it! I know! <laughs>